London, sing it! It's no longer news that Whiskey completely shut down O2 Arena between November 28 and December 1, 2021, for his much anticipated three days Made in Lagos concert. Apart from attracting a large crowd, after selling out three shows under 35 minutes, it also saw many Afrobeat artists perform, including Bella Schmoder, Buju, and Terms. Interestingly, the electric performances from the stable of Big Wiz are not the only thing that has got many people talking, but also a video where he tried to lift Terms in excitement. The video has many Terms and Big Wiz fans going gaga on Twitter. Sonny Joe Singer trying to lift Terms, but she was quick to stop him wiggling herself free from his hole just in time for them to continue with their performance. However, many people have read different meanings to Whiskey's actions. The most prominent is that Whiskey was trying to be sexual with Thames on stage and Thames' reaction was just a way of saying that their relationship is strictly business. Without slipping on the matter, Thames hours later came out to say that Whiskey is her brother, further pointing out that she had long brother zoned him and she is not about to become Tiwa, whom he enjoyed friends with benefit relationship with in the past. One, two, let's go! Hello guys, it's t here for African Glitz. From the get-go, fast-rising Afrobeat R&B alternative singer, Thames have always made it known that she is only about music and nothing extra. For this reason, she has shied away from selling her music with a sexual appeal or sexual content. She further reinforced her stand when she collaborated with Whiskey on Essence in 2020. For a song with such sexual lyrics, the music video came out without any form of sexuality from both Thames and Whiskey. But that didn't stop the song from being the 2021 Afrobeat anthem globally, the summer song of the year, and of course, the biggest song to come out of Africa in 2021. Indeed, Essence is one of the most streamed songs of the year 2021, opening both Thames and Whiskey to larger fan bases across the globe. It's no surprise that Justin Bieber had to beg Whiskey to jump on the song, making it the most successful Afrobeat remixes in a long time. With all this highlight and more, it's no surprise that Essence became the central selling point of the Whiskey Made in Lagos concert at the O2 Arena in London recently. Whiskey and many other Afrobeat artists such as Davido and Bonaboy have sold out O2 Arena London in the past, but no one ever sold out as fast as Whiskey Made in Lagos concert. The ticket had initially gone up for a day concert, but it sold out in 12 minutes, making Whiskey the seventh artist globally to sell out the O2 Arena in under 15 minutes. But that's not the only highlight. Whiskey and his crew made arrangements for a second event due to the demands of his fans, and it sold out in just two minutes. Again, due to popular demand, they added a third show, which sold out under 30 minutes. And this was how the Whiskey Made in Lagos concert in London became a three day show. According to a report, Whiskey raked in 5.2 billion naira only from ticket sales and made millions of naira more from the show's trimming. Of course, just like many anticipated, the concert was second to none, attracting many A list celebrities in Hollywood actress Gabriella Union, Stormzy, Chelsea player Romelu Lukaku, and our own dear Obikubana. <laughs> Interestingly, it was not drama free. Apart from people going wild over how Big Daddy Wheezy embodied all his performances during the concert, fans have also been given hot takes about this epic moment of Whiskey Dan Terms on stage. Many people on social media went wild, and several others read various meanings to it. While some fans think that Whiskey tried to carry Terms, she stopped him because she knew he could not, considering her size, others think he was trying to be sexual with her and called it an inappropriate act, synonymous to sexual harassment. Of course, Thames' refusal to oblige Jakey Clare to Whiskey that their relationship is strictly business. However, some people have returned to reference the video of Thames hugging Whiskey during a performance, claiming that Thames may have been giving Starboy the green light. But now, reacting during a show in Lafayette, London, Thames have surreptitiously affirmed that a relationship with Whiskey is nothing more than professional, confirming that the hug she gave him was a brotherly one. She said, uh, all I'm gonna say, yeah, all I'm gonna say is, um, Wiz is my brother, someone that I look up to, 
and I'm grateful for everything that he's done and his existence. And um, I want you, to, you guys to remember that he's human, I'm human. Miss Temps clearing the air, a fans, the rebel gang, have now begun hailing her for making it clear to Whiskey that she is different from Tiwa Savage and have no plans to imitate the kind of relationship he once shared with the Somebody Son crooner. Indeed, Whiskey and Tiwa Savage had what many would call a steamy relationship between 2018 and 2019. They collaborated on several songs including Malo, Fever, Bad and This Love. Like we all still remember, the music videos of these songs alongside her stage performances were not shut off steamy and romantic. Although they denied sharing anything more than a professional relationship, they were captured once kissing on stage. At the same time, Wizzy grabbed Tiwa's bot and several other times, they rocked each other like there is no tomorrow. But it seems like Thames is nothing and like Tiwa, it sure looks like the Crazy Things singer wasn't talking about Wizkid when she sang, only you fit old my buddy. Just in case you missed it, here are some reactions from Nigerians on Twitter. A user wrote, I hope Thames is okay though, that was so inappropriate. Another user wrote, Think Thames just didn't think Whiskey had it in him and saved both of them. No way he's able to lift her. I bet she'd let it happen if it was Stormzy or someone buff enough to actually pull it off. Nice save Thames, our star boy for Don Day Hospital now. Another wrote, Thames and conditions. Another wrote, Whiskey dragging his time on stage because he doesn't want to face Thames backstage yet. So tell us guys, what do you think of the video of Whiskey trying to lift Thames on stage? Would you say he was innocently trying to lift her in excitement or he tried to be sexual with her? Do you think Thames' reaction was a way of clarifying that she is not that kind of girl and strictly business between them? Lastly, do you think when she said Wiz is her brother, she was letting him know that she has brother zoned him? Let us know what you think in the comment section down below. If you found this video informative, please comment, like and share. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more well-researched African stories and news we know you would like. Click on the bell sign to be notified every time we upload a new video so that you don't miss out. Thanks for watching and see you on our next one.